Some Republicans want Medicare and Social Security to sunset. I'm not saying it's a majority. I'm not politely not naming them, but it's being proposed by some of you. Look, folks, the idea is that we're not going to be we're, we're not going to be moved into being threatened to default on the debt if we don't respond. What Biden said clearly outraged the lawmaker you just saw at the He's end of the upset. clip, Republican Senator really Mike upset. Lee of Utah, after the State of the Union, Lee discussed that contentious moment and accused President Biden of lying about his party's position. The president of the United States looked us right in the eye and mischaracterized what half the people in the chamber believe, what half the people in the chamber, according to him, want. It wasn't true. He looked a little bit confused when he pushed back on it. No, actually, well, no. No, actually it's Mike Lee who's confused. I know Mike, and I like Mike, but Mike's confused because, first of all, they booed Joe Biden when he said that one president, Donald Trump, raised the national debt more in four years than the United States of America raised the national debt over the first 220 years. True fact, they booed it. You're booing true facts? Why don't you boo it if he says that Philadelphia is going to be in the Super Bowl? It's as much of a fact. What was the next thing? Um, Republicans raised the debt ceiling three times under Donald Trump. They're, they're upset. They're booing that. Why? Boo. Because they were there. They did it. And the final thing I wrote down, they're so shocked and stunned that Joe Biden said, not all of you, but some of you want to sunset mm -hmm. Social Security and Medicare every five years. Mm -hmm. By the way, it's not a backbencher. Yeah. It was the guy that ran campaigns. He was the head of the Republican Senate Election Committee. And he wrote Rick it down. Scott. He wrote He's it got down. the plan. The sunset everything. And, uh -huh. and Mike Lee and the rest of them are saying it's a lie when they know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's the truth. And Mike Lee himself yeah, called it, for, quote, pulling up Social Security, mm -hmm. Medicare, and Medicaid by the roots. Let me say that again. Mike Lee, well, let's so say shocked it. and stunned and deeply saddened, called for pulling up social, his words, pu pulling up Social Security, Medicare, and Medicaid by the roots and getting rid of them. Take a look. I'm here right now to tell you one thing that you probably haven't ever heard from a politician. It will be my objective to phase out Social Security, nice. to pull it up by the roots and get rid of it. Um, people who advise me politically always tell me that's dangerous, and I tell them, in that case, it's not worth my running. That's why I'm doing this, to get rid of that. Medicare and Medicaid are of the same sort and need to be pulled up. Frazier is My down. <laughs> Frazier <Right>. is <laughs> down God. by himself. Yeah. Frazier hit himself hit with himself a left hook. Right. One of those, uh, <laughs> those teenagers. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but, but it demonstrates Self the power up. of audio and video. Yeah, you know mm -hmm. about because that. there it is right out of his own mouth. And by the way, Willie, this is the thing. Republicans <laughs> will sit there and act shocked and stunned and deeply sad when people say the truth about what their positions have been. Here we have Mike Lee doing it. He's on tape saying he wants to phase it out. He wants to pull it up by the roots. No, You've got the Republican popular. senator that ran campaigns for the, the, for the Senate having it down. They're writing it down. They're saying the quiet parts out loud. And then they act shocked last night when Joe Biden calls them on what but, they've said. Yeah, I think this is a theme, though, right? When you when you stop doing policy and you just do politics, where everything is a zero-sum game, a gesture. the other people right. are the enemy, then anything can be justifiable, any talking point, and you don't have any policy to undergird what you're saying. So they know that it's unpopular on a national stage to be cutting Social Security and Medicare. Well, he it's, says, to, he wants to 
destroy it. Right. So he, know, it out. he knows it's By unpopular the on the national stage, mm -hmm. but when he's sitting, I'm presuming, in front of a bunch of donors who are fiscally conservative, who want to do something about the debt, he will say privately what he will never say out loud. And I think that characterizes generally where we are with the Republican Party. They, they talk about abortion. We have to ban abortion. Then they see it's not so popular, that maybe we need a nuanced approach. So now they're all talking about a nuanced approach. You have to hear what people are saying to you, especially when they do it in private rooms. That is what they want. Yeah. Truly. So.